You've been waiting all day for this, and it's about time. Hi, everybody, along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski here for EA Sports. The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. And there's the puck drop. Enough talk. It's time to find out what this is all about. Sends the pass in front. Off a stick, and they can't complete the play. Shuts him down. He swallows that puck up as he slides across in the butterfly to make the save. And that plays offside. we got a face-off coming up. Lots of time left in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And he takes the feed. Shot. Too much congestion in front. Washington's got the puck in their own end. Poked away at center by Bergeron. Carolina's got it in the neutral zone. Here's a shot. Oh, he got by Dryden. Read of the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck, so the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Dunn's first touch on the puck is key to being able to make a play, guys. His magnetic zone ability means he can settle down a bouncing puck and get better control of it so it doesn't bobble away from him. Tried to get 2 Q with it and loses possession. I know what he's trying to do, get into space to shoot it, but now you got to chase because you've turned it over. Great burst of speed to come up with it. The Capitals play it along the board. Couldn't make the connection on the play. And he regains control of the puck. The Capitals have it from their own end. Here's a chance. Handles the pass. Washington's got possession here in the neutral zone. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Look at this, it's a two-on-one. And he takes the dish. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. The Capitals have it now. Moves it over to Wolf. And we're going to get a face-off after the offside. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. We're still scoreless. Carolina's won it. Moves it to Saint-Jacques. And offside, we'll get a reset here. Copeland's hard to shove off the puck because he's got such great strength and balance, guys. We call that his unstoppable force zone ability, and it's what really helps him maintain possession for his team. Puck picked up in the open ice. Taken along the wall by Bergeron. Trozinovic has taken the puck now here inside his own territory. Dunn's taking it from his own end. Puck scooped up by Wolf. Stays with it. You'll need more than that to beat him. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. 
the midway mark of the frame. James and Ray with you tonight. Still no score in this one. Wolves won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. Can't connect as it goes off a stick. Playing big in the moment there. Oh, wow, another great stop. Moves it quickly over to Trezanovich. Fires it. Turned aside with a glove by Dryden. Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Copeland's going to play it against the half wall. And that's broken up. Carries the puck up through center. Great defensive effort breaking up the pass. Picked up along the boards by Young. And now it's grabbed by Bergeron. And he passes it up ahead to Trezanovic. Drives to the sweet spot. Comes up with a monster save in front. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Carolina's won the faceoff. Oh, how did that stay out? What a save by Dryden. Get that slop out of here. He makes the stop, and there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Bergeron stick handling in his own zone. And he moves it up to Trezanovich. The Capitals scoop it up along the boards. Play is called for offside. Getting into the later stages of this period, the game is still scoreless. Carolina's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Quick pass to Wolf. Watch out! Pass over to Young. Reaches out and uses the stick. Barnett's lugging the puck. And now it's over to Bergeron. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Carolina's got the puck against the boards. Let's it go from the slot. And that's deflected on someone in front. The Capitals gain the zone. The 360 with the puck. What a shot. I mean, really good play, but it hits the post. And like everything else in this game, it stays out of the net. Centers glide into the dot as the faceoff ready to resume play. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. Wolves won the draw and they'll look to set up. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action. Stick around. Welcome back, everybody. James Sabalski with you. Period number two. The middle frame ready to go. Still looking for the game's first goal as we are underway in the second. There's the whistle icing the call. Lots of time left in this period. Still scoreless in this one. The Hurricanes take possession off the faceoff. You could be a little more aggressive here. You know the other team's tired. They just want to get the puck and clear the zone. Turned aside by the goaltender. 
Dryden's going to cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the faceoff. The Hurricanes win it. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Young. A chance with the three on Please, try again. Stopped by the goaltender. Slides across in the butterfly to make the save, but you still have to be agile even though you're covering the bottom of the net. Bergeron's moving the puck through his own zone. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Here's a short pass to Brindamore. And he makes the save. Quick feed to Dunn. The Capitals take it across the line. Now a quick pass to Dunn. Taken by Wolf. Oh, much respect as he blocks that one. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Sends it in deep. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. Slides it over with pace to Burnett. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Wolf's going off to the box for two minutes. Our first look tonight at their power play unit. Obviously, goals have been hard to come by. Here's the first power play of the game. Young's won it in their own end. Puck slid down the ice. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. brindamore has got it behind the net. Picks up the puck. Washington's gained possession. Carolina's got a hold of it along the wall. It's it throws one of the game's better shooters. You cannot leave him alone. He does not miss them. Giving themselves control of this game now with a one goal lead in the second. They'd like to get another before they go in for the second intermission. You'd love at least a couple goal lead going into period three. Washington's looking to break out of their own end. And not much on that one. Dryden's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Carolina's ahead, 1-0. Washington's won the face-off deep in their own end. Into the corner. Washington's got the puck along the boards. That pass doesn't go. Bergeron's got the puck in his own zone. Nice feed. Play is blown dead with the offside. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. The Hurricanes win possession here in the open ice. Rocks him on the play. Scores and that the win is his first goal with his Philly ASHL team. The excitement that he displays when that puck goes into the net, you know how much this means. You will never forget your first goal. Grabs the puck at center. Washington's got possession at center. Carolina's got the puck. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Couldn't complete the pass. Puck grabbed by Copeland. Gaining momentum up along the side. Moves it to Copeland. And that goes off a player. And another stop. Why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Carolina's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Wolf's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Into the offensive end now. There's a solid collision. And that's poked away by Bergeron. Feeds the puck to Saint-Jacques. The Hurricanes play along the wing. And that misses. Puck picked up by Bergeron. Puts it towards the net. Rebound, 
don't get very many goals where you have time to dust off the puck and shoot it. Lots of them are just like this, James. You get into the interior of the ice, fight for your position, and whatever you have to do, jam it past the goalie. Couldn't make that one happen. The Hurricanes move the puck out of the defensive zone. Here they come on the rush. Washington's got control of it now from their own end. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. Wolf's got it in the defensive end. Shot! Oh, what a stick save, and it stays out. Dryden's one of the group today for sure. It's not been very good from him all the way out. And we'll get a breather here with offside the call. Here in the late goings of the period, Carolina's got a three-goal lead. Washington's won the draw in the neutral zone. Into the attacking end. Off his stick! Denies him in front! Massive spill in the corner! Good hit on the play. And it's a quick pass to Copeland. Carolina's looking to break out. Feeds it to Trazanovic. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Tries that last move. Maybe he should just shoot the puck or get it deep. Got a chase now. Slides the puck ahead to Brindamore. Washington's looking to break out of their own end. The Hurricanes gain possession along the wall. And there's the horn, two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. You're having a great night. Two periods down. One more to go, and they're ready to drop the puck here on period number three. Curious to see if there was any message sent in the room in that second intermission because it has been a blowout thus far. I wonder if they might even just run the clock. 40 minutes into this one here. Razor, how do you see things? The Hurricanes have been terrific for 40 minutes. Now a comfortable lead that they'll just try to ease their way into the finish line. goalie's perspective there's so much traffic they can't see so he just drops into the butterfly hopes he's in the right position but that puck sees some air and it beats him clean that's a solid hit on that play and that somehow stayed out of the net Dryden's gonna bounce on it and he'll take the whistle he's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway and so the opportunity to kill the play he's gonna take it Still plenty of time left in this frame. Carolina's now up by four. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. From the back of the cage with the puck. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Nice save by the keeper to trap that puck in his chest. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Pass broken up. And here's the pass to Copeland. Play develops. It's a two-on-one. Carolina's got it in their own zone. And now he passes up to Brindamore. Puck scooped up by Bergeron. And now it's grabbed by Dunn. 
And he passes it up ahead to Young. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. Takes it to the net. Wow. Oh. One foot, two's better. He finishes off this opportunity, and now it's a great night. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Carolina's putting on one of their most impressive offensive displays we've seen in a while. He got robbed again. He's got to get his head up here, or you're going to be carting him off the ice. Makes it look easy with the stop. We're going to face off after the puck stays covered up. Krasinovich has got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Solid hit on the play. Passes it to Krasinovich. And a smart heads-up play to put that away by Bergeron. Washington's got it in their own zone. Rocks him. And that pass can't connect. Taken by Copeland. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. Oh, tremendous reflexes with the pad. What a stop by Dryden. Great A chance. Right in the middle of the ice, and the goaltender makes the stop. Carolina's defense has been exceptional. They've defended well, kept the front of the net clean, and whenever there's a rebound, they get it out of there fast. The Hurricanes ready to go on the attack. And he makes the save on that play. Young's into the offensive zone now on the attack. Fails to find the open man. Feeds it over to Brindamore. Oh, what a chance here. Can they make it happen on this 2 on one Carolina's got the puck now. Made the stop on the play. Moves into the slot. Puck grab by Copeland. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Here's a chance behind the net. Comes up with the stop. The Hurricanes will play it in their own end. Past the midway mark in this period. One-sided, lopsided, blowout, you name it. 5-0 is where we're sitting. Washington's won the draw. Carolina's got the puck in the defensive end. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Here in the late going of the frame, it's a 5-0 hockey game. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Odd man rush. Feeds it over the attack. You gotta finish him off. The chances are going to be so far away. It's a great play, and now we can celebrate his three goal night. Now, would you ever wear one of those chapeaux? Not a chance. Did you wear someone else's hat? Absolutely not. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Goes full circle with the puck. And that pass attempt is deflected. Seychelles got it now deep inside his own end. Here's a chance. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. I don't even know if they're looking for good news anymore, James. They just want the news that the game is over. This penalty doesn't help. Teams use this 1-3-1 one, one a lot. They like the creativity that you can shoot the puck from either side. You can use the bumper spot. And you always have traffic in front of the net. Here's a chance in front. Oh, and they can't connect on the pass because it was broken up in front. Can't pull the trigger. Steps into the offensive end. What a steal in his own end. Moves the puck to Drezinovich. Center and feed. Great defensive hits up play to pick it off. Getting a little physical there with that collision. Can't make the connection on the pass. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck along the boards. Can't make it work. And he's got the puck. Good night. He doesn't miss from there. Carolina's 
only continue to extend the lead here in the third. They haven't missed many chances. They've scored at will, and now we're coasting home. Moves it quickly over for Brindamore. This one-sided affair finally nearing the end. Look at the Savardian spinorama. Denies the shooter on that play. He reads the play to get across in the butterfly, but you still have to be agile because that puck can change directions on you. Sends a pass over. Quick pass to Drozanovic. And he comes up with it. Carolina's grab a hold of the puck. Moves it around along the half wall. Rest arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Everything seems to be moving in slow motion. Now that penalty stops the clock on the way to the end of this game. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Officials have got both teams ready, and it looks like play is set to resume here. Carolina's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Now over to Brindamore. Takes it to the front. Swing and a miss. And he puts it in off the ring. Yeah, they didn't take very much time. The official had his arms up in the hurt. They've got to be mindful to stay calm. I know the call went against them, but we're about to drop the puck here again. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. And that's it! Now, this has got to have a nice special feeling. First shutout with his new EASHL squad. Nice confidence booster. Booster, it's got to be great. Well, I don't know how it wouldn't be. I mean, you want to come in and do the job for your new team. You want them to have confidence in you. And to throw an egg up on the board really gives them a, a, something to look at in goal and think, hey, we might have found something here.